heavy police presence is being maintained in the Mova district after residents burned tires and debris blocking the free flow of traffic on the Lady Young Road this morning. Police say eight people have been detained. The protests started from as early as four this morning. The residents were voicing their dissatisfaction with their MP and what they described as constant promises. The residents complained of a lack of jobs, no water and poor infrastructure in the community. However, the protest came to a halt when police and fire officers arrived on the scene to get the situation under control. Sharon Lee Lewis has more. A standoff with police officers and some residents after law enforcement and fire officers arrived on Lady Young Road, where residents blocked the road with fiery debris. This protest, which went on for just over three hours simultaneously at Chinapu, Lady Young, and in the vicinity of Fernandez Compound on the eastern main road, was unsettling to both motorists and pedestrians. The protesting residents of Mova say they are fed up with just promises from MP Adrian Leons. Uh, the MP promising work every day. Every day you go by your office, it promises, promises. It's years now, two years of promises. We fed up our promises, family. You understand? And this is picture. This is where the MP from. You understand? Do we have a CPEP at by URP? We are the maintain we own we own place, you understand? We fed up at that. Darim says the Mova youths can't get jobs and this is frustrating. We live in borders still, boy. Some people up here live in borders still, like it, like like we live in 1958. Yeah, but there's no water, and nothing. So we supposed to do, boy? We say, but it's first time move up, come together. The whole of move up, come together for this because we fed up. You understand? There's no war going on, no killing going on, no shooting going on. So we had to come together and voice your opinion and show what we be going on. Following the protest, the residents met with their MP at his office in an attempt to find an amicable solution. Sherilyn Lewis, CNews. CNews contacted the Member of Parliament for Mova Laventil, Adrian Leons, who confirmed today's protest was due to a lack of jobs for residents. He said the Minister of Works visited the area over the weekend and made several promises for job opportunities, but could not say when that will start. They don't have any work around any area, so they, they had to do the tend to get employment. What kind of job, if you have any idea, that he was looking well, at? Well, it will be um, drainage, infrastructure, which is in a um, road, road, road projects and all kind of stuff. So you'll be providing employment for the, for the residents and you'll also be improving their way of life. He said the residents are within their rights to protest. However, lighting fires may not be the best way to go. I cannot tell them, don't be upset and don't be agitated. What I can tell them is, is blocking the roads and protesting. Sometimes that's not the best solution, you know, it, 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 it hampers everything. But um, to go out and, and tell them, don't protest, and they don't have a reason to be upset. You know, I try my best to, to get them, you know, we, where we could wait a little longer and be a little more patient until something happens. Up to news time, the residents had held off and on any further protest actions after meeting with the MP who committed to easing their plight.